York man is in the Polk County Jail tonight after being sentenced for sexually assaulting a woman inside a Des Moines hotel room. 30 year old Christopher LaPointe pled guilty to charges of burglary and sexual abuse. KCCI's Cynthia Fodor joins us live tonight from the Embassy Suites downtown to show us just what happened. Cynthia? Well, Kevin and Steve, this is a wake up call for everyone who stays in hotels. After a man entered a woman's room in this hotel after midnight one night. Police say the New Jersey woman here on business in April tried to ignore the New York man in the hotel bar. But after she went up to her room on the eighth floor. After she had gone to bed, um, heard her room door open, woken up when the suspect was standing next to her. And the Des Moines Police Sexual Abuse Report says suspect woke her by touching her leg. She asked how he got into her room. He said he had friends. The victim states she was terrified. He placed his hands down her pajama bottoms. Suspect asked victim to touch him. She refused and froze. It was done against her will, without her permission, a non-consensual sexual contact, basically. So how did Chris LaPointe get in the room? Police say the desk clerk gave him a key, recognizing him as a frequent guest and Hilton Honors Diamond member. We just happened to spot this room key card laying on the sidewalk, which we were able to determine is still active. A good reminder to always keep your hotel key in a secure place. The Embassy Suites general manager released this statement, providing a safe and comfortable environment for our guests and employees is of the utmost importance to hotel management. We are fully cooperating with local authorities during an investigation of the unfortunate incident. To maintain privacy, we do not disclose details as a policy. The Marriott and most hotels have a strict policy on giving out room keys. They still have to provide identification for us. Um, the only exception to that would be is if they left their identification in their room. We would send one of our security officers up to verify with them that it is exactly their room. And once in your room, use the deadbolt and bar lock so that someone cannot open the door even with a key. Now, police say that Pierce LaPointe was in the woman's room for about two hours. He has been sentenced now to 20 years in prison on burglary and sex abuse charges. Kevin?